everybody, welcome back to another episode of my current household family. Uh, as a reminder, we still live here in my circle house that I made. Um, and yeah, so let's start with introducing the family again. This here is Rohan Elderberry. He is the father in the household. Then we have Ivy Elderberry, who is the mom. Then we have the son, Juniper. He is one of the three triplets that we have. Then there's Iris in her bathing suit down here, talking to her dad, doing her homework. Uh, she was just outside swimming. I don't know why she didn't change, but whatever. Then, the third triplet is Ginger. They're all a bit, you know, they all look different. They all have their own style, which is great. I love when Sims turn out this way. Um... She's talking to their cat, Cleo. And then the final and last one is Anora. Anora has uh, her own set of skills. She is kind of different than any sim I've ever had. I've never had a sim, like, tinker with this. But I think she'd be kind of cool to, like, have her build a robot or something and have a servo bot in her house. So I think that'd be kind of fun. Uh, I think she's going to be the one I continue on with because for the triplets I had to cheat them into reality so the only one that actually it says is theirs is Anora's so that's who I'm going to continue with I think um and then we also have our adopted sister here um Ellie who is now with Max uh Villarreal who is part of the Renegades uh, I, Anora doesn't have anybody yet, Ginger doesn't have anyone yet, she was really, really interested in Lloyd, but Lloyd told her that he didn't really see a future with them, um, but, yeah, so she doesn't really have anybody, she's been flirting around with a couple of kids of any gender, she doesn't really care, uh, her most interest right now is Courtney. And then Junie is with Seema, um, who's part of the chess team. Um, and she likes country fashion, rocker fashion, and she's into a bunch. Men for romance, messing around, it doesn't matter. Sweethearts, though, the sh her and Junie have been always a thing, so she's, I think she's happy to stay with Junie. She's promised herself to him. They're best friends, and they're she he perceives her as attractive. Uh, his sentiments about her is that he it has a major crush on her, and they are emotionally expressive. Seema's sentiments about Juni are that um, he was her crush. And then, first impression, interesting sim, and deeply connected. So they were both kind of crushing on each other pretty hard. Which is really cute. I think that the two of them have found a very happy relationship. I really hope that they continue to grow and build the family out, but we'll see. My teens have four days, well these three have four days until they age. She just aged up into a teenager 12 days ago, or she's at 12 days ago. Ivy and her husband have about 15 days until they're elders. And I think the cat is still a young adult. Or an adult, yeah. I don't know why she's scratching on her bed, but... Rohan is kind of focusing his life on recording videos, which is actually bringing in quite a lot of money for the family. And then he's also working in the uh, officer, or the police officer, or de detective career. Um, I think what I'm going to start doing, um, other than Anora here, is trying to, like, start, so, like, when you go to join a career. I don't know if these guys have the option to go to teenagers for everything yet. But, 
when you join a career, maybe. I haven't paid the bill. Um. Well, let me finish the video, but when you join a career, you have like multiple different, you know, pals or whatever you can take with a career. So I think what I'm going to start doing was with all of my errors is trying to set them up to do the best for the next career in line. So we can try all the careers. So. Um, so, I want to see what the next one is. I know with her, she's kind of on the path for already doing, um, already doing something scientifically or the robots or, you know, whatever. But after her, her child, I think we're going to start doing that. I think the first couple are interactive. So yeah, the first couple are interactive, so his would be up here too, the police or the detective of the career. Um, so that one, the doctor and the scientist, would be the first ones. Then we'd start with actor, then going astronaut, then athlete, then business, then going down the line just so we can try to like experience them all. Because I've never had a sim, and like I think it'd be kind of fun to like, because these ones you don't make as much. So like... To have a sim live off of, you know, I think whatever the lowest one is. 16. So I think that was the lowest one I just saw. 16. Fast food employee. To have a sim try to live off of $16 an hour and, you know, work 6 to 10 or 5 to 9 and then have a family on top of that i think that would be kind of cool so we're gonna we're gonna kind of try to do that <laughs> as we continue on but for now we're just kind of exploring with these guys so yeah this will be our next sim that we're following i'm really excited to get her out of the house because there is a lot of people in this house um so we're trying or i'm trying to get, you know, I'm trying to have her do her best in her career, excuse me, all while building everyone else's careers. Um, so it's not really, it's not hard, but it's not going great. <laughs> so I'm going to have everybody stop doing what they're doing and like get themselves situated for bed because it's three in the morning. Um, and I think that, you know, the teens have school tomorrow, so we should probably get them all in bed. But, I don't know what he's, what are you doing? Resume that. Oh, don't. Are you frozen? Okay, well, we're gonna just... Can I have you? Can you resume it now? Can you finish eating this? And then. And then when you wake up, maybe we can have you do more there. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, man, oh, man. All right, so we're going to have them just kind of get themselves situated I think if if I can Gosh, everything's breaking
I don't know where that music is coming from. You need to stop playing the guitar for now. Get some food and get to bed. She might pass out on the floor. Ivy. So I think we'll keep, I think tomorrow like I can actually follow her to school for the first time. So I'd like to do that if I can. I want her to be like fully ready in like if you know. So seven o'clock I might wake her up and have her do her homework and use the bathroom and um try to just get her fully prepared for the day. And if she's got time to sleep some more, I might have her sleep more. Enora. Enora, you're not doing your homework, why? What? <laughs> I want you to do your homework. <laughs> Everyone starts doing about an hour. Uh, okay. I think your homeworks are done. Do your homework. If you have not done your homework, why are you why? Guess we're going with all of them. I don't know if they have time to get their homework done or not, but we're gonna try. We are going to try to get homework done when they get there. If they get their homework done before class and they have time to mingle, then we can have them mingle. But, for now. Okay. I'd like to have, I think it's Ginger. I think it's Ginger. Yeah, Ginger and Anora. I'd like to have them, like, scan the area, see if anyone they, is there that they find attractive. So I'm gonna have to just quickly press on Ginger and have her scope the surroundings. <laughs> oh, what is that? Okay, I've never seen that before. Um, so it says, Anora. Too many sims in one place. Is this max capacity? If, or is this now a fire hazard? What if the grounds open up? Maybe it is time for Anora to sneak out. I've never, never seen that before. I think that's kind of cool. Like, she's just like, there's too many people around. I can't do this. I think she's just nervous about her first day. Um, let's see if it says anything. Uh -huh. Um, I can't tell because those are the two that lit up for Ginger. After an hour, I finished the scope in the room. She notices one that has sparked her interest. Where? Where? I don't see who you're talking about. Uh, can you scope again, please? I'd like to know who you're talking about. Okay, is there. Come over here. Yes. 
Can you just, like, introduce oh. yourself to people? Okay, so she doesn't find anyone out here attractive. Can we come over here? Oh, we gotta go fast. Go to class. I'm gonna follow Honora around today because I feel like I've followed the other ones enough. This is her first day in high school. Like, she probably is nervous, is probably not enjoying herself here. Where's. I don't know else. Ginger's here. Iris. She's not in class at all. Go to class. Oh, it's on shop. Okay. I want her to kind of just. Where did the one go that she found attractive? Is it you, maybe? Maybe? Anora, where are you? Hon honey? I just want to find out if it's her. Or him. Where did he go now? She's just not finding anyone attractive, is she? Too many sims from fear of crowded places. That's a new one I've never seen. It is you. Okay. So you think that he is attractive. But no. So now she's got a fear of crowded spaces. Huh. Okay. Nora, things are starting to get a little claustrophobic here, and Nora can only focus on mind over matter for so long before she wants to leave and find somewhere uh -huh. less crowded. Yeah. Huh, fear of crowded places. There are too many sims around right now. Nora will be tense if two for around too many sims on the same lot. <laughs> Interesting. I've never seen that fear. Like, she's always been a sociable child. Maybe that's why she enjoys, um, her tinkering. And maybe she, that's why she's, you know, okay with robots, but not people. Did you even introduce yourself to that kid that you thought was cute? No, you didn't, because you're afraid. Okay. Are you going to class? Pampini Musker. So, I think you need to come in here and attend your social. Um, your social studies class or whatever. Um. Well, I think she was a little late for her class, but can you go introduce yourself to this kid now? Like, actually, get to know him. Thank you. 
Alright. So he thinks she's admirable and she finds him interesting. <laughs> Yeah. Yes, like, hey, Anora, how you doing? Ah. Uh, let's ask for reassurance. Maybe we can ask him to prom as friends. Really? Uh -huh. Oh. Oh. Sima doesn't oh. like Sini. me. As her. She thinks that we're pretentious. Alright, well, let's... Manifest! Uh, Juniper, why don't you come to my book? Talk to her. <laughs> ask her to prom. Wait on her face. Runa Bumbido! Ask her to prom. Yes! And then you can introduce yourself to this kid. Who is your... crush? Here? No, is she just... Oh, she's too old for school now. That's cool. Can you, like... Can you just go for surrounding? There is literally no one here anymore. Everybody's in here. How do you go in here? Him and Judy are going to prom together, or her and Judy are going to prom together. Uh, not smart. Why don't you, like, talk with him? Right in this day. This is the girl, oh. another girl that you thought was friendly, not you, but all right. Ah. <laughs> 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 Oh, 
Sorry. Mm. Yeah. yeah. What? Vanish? I don't know where Prom is. Fuck you. Duffy. I don't know where Prom is. <laughs> So, like, the only one I have to worry about is a Nora going to come Honky Steve. Steve. Oh. Yes, yes! yes. <gasps> Batinati! What's the miss you, boy? Cool. I don't know. But, she's got this huge crush on him. Her first impression was crush. But, like, it's grown to this full blown crush now. Bunichi, Parsifae, Robin! Gulardo, Venosa, Batinati, Tanini! What? But, yeah, I don't know. And I'm not going, to, the kids that I choose not to follow their paths, I'm not gonna worry about setting them up with someone. If they have a partner, then I'll move them out together with that partner, but I'm not going to worry about setting them up with someone before moving them out. With the new story progressions, um, They'll find partners and stuff on their own, so like, if, if they find someone that they're gonna be with, I'll CC them up, but like, yeah. Okay, so, Honora, right now, is pretty good. She has nothing too crazy going on in her, you know, Honora's too uncomfortable. What do you mean? Anora's literally out here. Okay, this is breaking. I don't know why. I don't know what's going on. Uh, give me a second. I'm gonna try to fix it. If it doesn't work, then I guess we're gonna have to. There we go. Alright, so. I'll have him stop what he's doing. Go use the bathroom. Have this get cleaned up. I'll have him start cooking some dinner for everyone. I don't know why it keeps doing that. This corner keeps like cutting out and disappearing. Okay, we're gonna have her catch a shower. I don't know where the cat is. Cat sounds very distressed to find out what's wrong. Oh my gosh, I don't know why it's doing this. But it's driving me kind of crazy. Okay. He's swimming and then he's gonna go clean up. He's not enjoying it because he's got a condition of raspy lungs. Can you? No. You can't even keep swimming. How about going and relaxing then? I was gonna have him do his homework, but I don't know if he can. He's thinking about going to a doctor, so maybe he needs to go to the doctor. Okay, um, well, I'm do his homework and then he can go back to swimming if he wants to. She can do her homework and take a shower. Ginger. Ginger's 
alright with things. So she can technically... Come in and... You do your homework. Come do your homework. And then you can... Practice some writing again. I want Juni to... Is this something new that's happening, or is this just something I'm experiencing right now? Okay, let's not leave our homework out there. You can do that, and then you can come enter a novice tournament. you come in and play a game just to kind of relax um all right if it keeps happening i'm gonna just stop recording and see if that helps fix it but right now i don't see that helping I do have her build a mechanism. I don't know why this is happening to me. Alright. I'm gonna have her get rid of this because he didn't want to be with her and I just want to see if everyone's on their homework. Alright. I think I'm going to end this part here. If you guys enjoyed it and you want to see more in the comment section below, please let me know. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. And yeah, you guys have a wonderful day, night, evening, wherever you are. And bye everyone!